nació aquí en San Ángel. Juan El Charro Díaz began his musical career over 60 years ago in Coahuila, Mexico. In 1953, the owner of the radio station XEBX in Sabinas listened to me. Doors began opening for Díaz, who began singing on the radio and then at special events. That's when the name Juan El Charro Díaz became recognized. Díaz arrived to San Angelo from Mexico in 1964. He lived here for a few years while hosting a radio show on KSJT La Grande and playing in a musical trio. We wanted to conquer San Angelo. After some time, he moved to San Antonio, where he recorded his first 10 songs. Then I left to California. I recorded songs there, too. I was there with my family for a while before we returned to San Angelo. Over the years, Diaz has recorded over 50 original Mexican country songs about the places, the foods, and the people that make the Mexican culture. One of his most special songs, San Angelo. It's about experiences, gratitude to the town, to the people. It's about part of my life. With his guitar in hand, Diaz humbly recognizes his accomplishments as a musician. I'm not famous, but I do have a musical career. When I go home, they like to put me on magazines and newspapers. They like listening to me. You know, I'm actually playing for the Sabinas municipal president later this month. Diaz hasn't just received acknowledgments from his home country. A few years ago, he received a recognition by the then mayor of the city of San Angelo, Duane Morrison, for his musical career. An inspiration to many, his lyrics serve as a reminder to Mexican immigrants of where they came from and why they came to this country. I just don't want them to forget their roots. Porque aquí soy muy feliz. Mis hijos ya están sirviendo. This year, Diaz turned 86 years old, and he says he's not putting his guitar away anytime soon. As long as I have a voice and as long as God allows me to, I'll keep singing. Amanda Lozano, KSA News. Gracias.